Hi, I'm Alan SoCal, and I'm reviewing the uh, Kingjoy uh, tripod. Uh, you know, I've been using tripods uh, most of my uh, adult life uh, because that's when I basically got into freelancing, uh, photographic, and um, the majority of my work was uh, in my studio area where most of my tripods were heavy not light. I remember getting a little mini tripod made out of aluminum many years ago and it was sort of a novelty. Um, I probably, well, minimally used it. Uh, so I've never really found great use for tripods that are small, small, micro small. Uh, until, of course, videography hit strong, and then we had the smartphone, and, and the world changed. So I, of course, am trying to change with it. The Kingjoy tripod is uh, advertised uh, positively as a very light tripod, and I guess for some people that's a good thing. Uh, for me, I prefer a tripod that's a little heavier. It can be small, but I still want the weight because of stability. So this tripod falls somewhere in the middle of that. Um, it's got some interesting features, one of which, uh, when you uh, take the center stock and extract it, oy, well, it, it uh, self-expanded. Uh, you can take the center uh, stock here, which is connected to the uh, tripod head, and you can then extend it out like uh, many devices that have these uh, tube within a tube extensions. I guess you can't even see it at that height. But the point is, you end up with a monopod accessory. Uh, I just have never found use for monopods like this, and I would make a, a, an observation. This tripod is so small to begin with that if I ever were in a situation where I didn't have room to use a tripod, I would simply close the legs up, bring them in, but then I would then extend them all the way down, and that would give me my monopod. Uh, so that feature, you know, Maybe I'll discover a use one day, but other than that, I don't know. As far as the lightweight, uh, I notice they do give a hook at the bottom, and I don't know how many of you have ever tied a sandbag or, uh, you know, uh, shored up a tripod with sandbags. I've done that, and um, uh, frankly, that is a good weight, is a sandbag weight. You can sometimes get the weightlifter's weights or, uh, you know, a boat anchor. <laughs> Anything that you can connect to this hook that'll hold the tripod down and secure it, that's a good idea. That makes this a heck of a lot more stable. The fact that it's light, they've also incorporated a little handle here for carrying, which I thought was cute. Uh, again, I've never had the luxury of a handle on a small tripod, but all these things add up to a price point of $40. Uh, let me just let you know that I did my Amazon research. I looked at comparatives. Uh, yes, this tripod with all its features is at $40. Uh, there is another tripod available, a comparative, uh, all the features here minus the monopod. So forget pulling this out. It's just the tripod. And I frankly, I don't remember if it had the handle. So there you would save $4. Not really very much, huh? Uh, if you want to spend uh, another couple dollars, uh, $2 more, you can get a name brand version of this. Uh, from a very, very reputable uh, supplier of lighting equipment and a few other uh, items. So, uh, you know, one of the reasons I gave this four stars, I, I thought it was a good tripod for the current market, but there's an option to get it minus the monopod where you save a few dollars. 
not much, six dollars, but still. Uh, and then, of course, uh, if you spend just a little more, you can purchase from a name brand vendor. However, I know that Kingjoy offers other size tripods. They do have a, a lesser, uh, uh, lower price point tripod, uh, which is different, doesn't have the monopod. I believe it's even lighter, may not extend to the uh, full extension. This one does 70 inches or so. Um, Yes, you do get accessories. Almost all the tripods I've looked at offer a smartphone accessory. This one they toss in another one of those uh, shutter tripping uh, Wi-Fi uh, uh, wireless or Bluetooth wireless uh, trip uh, buttons. So I think it's a solid four star. For some people that want the monopod, I guess it's a full five. Uh, I would actually prefer it were even heavier than this. As I said, I do have some stow-and-go tripods that have always been in my vehicles. And uh, one of them, which is a little bit larger than this, in fact, I'm looking at it over on the floor over there uh, in this recording area, uh, it's all aluminum with some high-density plastic. This is not what I'd call high density plastic. So I lose the weight that I want, the natural weight with the type of plastic and nowadays uh, less costly tripods. Again, solid uh, four stars for me, uh, for you with the monopod, the carrying handle, the fact that it's light, uh, but it does have a hook at the bottom for stability. You might give it a five. I think it's still a reasonable value.